Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Fahd Dada. I talk about real estate, a lot about Dubai real estate, your life and your path to financial freedom. Given the current C outbreak that we're all in, I thought I'd bring you some clarifications from the Dubai real estate market. It's no secret that the one main biggest developer in Dubai and perhaps the region with 51,000 plus apartments, townhouses, villas, etc. delivered not just in Dubai but across the region, Pakistan, Egypt, Turkey and so forth is Imar. Obviously, as the market leader, everybody's looking to see what Imar is doing. Now, some nefarious people leaked or spread rumors that Imar's projects have stalled or they've stopped construction. Now, I can tell you one thing. I've lived through the global financial crisis of 2008, 9, 10, 11, 12 in Dubai and I was involved in the real estate market. If you can bank your money on somebody as a developer at that time was Imar. If any investors were hurt for any reason, Imar made sure that it did good by them, made sure that their deliveries of apartments, townhouses, etc., etc., came through, even if they were delayed. So it goes to say that Muhammad al Abbar, uh, who was the chairman of Imar, had to come out into uh, and, and, and release a press release saying that, look, our projects have not stopped construction, uh, we are still going forth. The only thing is, with the current lockdown situation, it only takes very little brains for anybody to figure out that we've obviously slowed down on some of the sites, you know, because of logistical reasons. It makes sense, right? Dubai right now, Alhamdulillah, uh, bless the UAE, has had one of the lowest cases of the C outbreak, right? Uh, the lowest cases and, and even better, one of the lowest deaths, right? Which is great. So the Dubai government has placed restrictions on the lockdown situation. Uh, to, to halt and eradicate the spread of this situation, the virus, right? So Imar had to come out and had to make a statement that, look, we've not stopped any of our sites, so any of the nefarious news outlets that have released that news are absolutely false. We've just slowed down and we're managing our supply chain, our workers, logistically, which makes sense, right? But it also goes to speak about the kind of developer that Imar is and the kind of developer that you might be seeking to place your money with if you're looking to invest in real estate in Dubai. Now is the time you can probably pick up good deals. Uh, every developer, every seller, every supplier is ramping up their promotional, uh, so to speak, their sales and marketing around making those sales. So if you want to place your trust, you place it with somebody who's been around there for 20 plus years, has a long history of 50 1,000 plus, I think it's 55,000 now, of deliveries of units, apartments, townhouses, villas, and last but not the least, they're out there engaging with the market and being very transparent. And I read one other news that across the board, they've actually, um, Mohamed al Abar, who's the, who's the chairman of the company, has taken his own salary, personal salary, to zero, right? Here's a role model who's paving the way and showing the way forward to his staff, to his employees. And the general mood around in the UAE is everybody coming together in a spirit of hope, we'll get through this. And there is no blame game going on over here. Everybody's in this together, we move forward together. And there's a lot of support for the community, for the people who might need it, from the banks, from the uh, malls where the retail outlets are suffering, from the government, from the central bank. There's a lot of packages being announced to make sure that those who might be suffering or who might need it the most will come through this with flying colors. So just want to clarify that, let you guys know, if you're going to be investing, invest with the market leader. I personally think Imar is one of those. What it says on the tin can is what you get. There's no surprises throughout the process. Yet again, you do need somebody down on the ground to be able to assess a project individually, check the views, see if you're making the right decision. If you want help with those things, reach out to me, my number's below. This number works for WhatsApp, you can reach out to me. It's the quickest way for me to respond to you. Email also works. Hit the subscribe button, press the bell icon, 
helps me keep you engaged. If you've got any questions that are general, put them in the comment section or you can ask me on WhatsApp. I'll answer for everybody's benefit. My name is Fadda. Talk about real estate, Dubai, anywhere in the world if you want to invest. Get my secrets map to investing in real estate without losing money. It's called the real estate secrets map.com. I help you with your life and your path to financial freedom. Together we move forward. Press the bell, uh, subscribe button, hit the bell icon. Talk to you soon. Take care. Ciao for now.